Okay, so today uh, what we're looking at is the constructing a contour map lab. Looks like that. <clears throat> All right, so um, on contour maps, um, besides the lines on there to uh, represent uh, elevations, um, they all, there's also stuff called culture on the maps. And what culture is, it's mostly man-made features that you find in a certain area. Uh, so on the maps, and now there's many, many symbols, but uh, just an example of some of them. A little black square typically represents a house. A little black square with a flag on it represents a school. A little black square with a cross on it represents a church. Uh, crossing pickaxes is a mine. A uh, thing that looks like a zipper is a railroad track. Uh, the dash kind of square shaped thing with a little cross in it, or sometimes it may have CEM written in it. That's a cemetery. Uh, that symbol right there is a marsh. Um, that right there would be a dam. You can see how the water's backed up and there's a stream coming out of the dam. A uh, road like that would be a paved road. A road like that would be a dirt road. Um, a benchmark, what a benchmark is, is when they're surveying the land, they periodically uh, have these things right here. And what they do with them is they embed them into the bedrock and they use it as a reference point to measure from. And what it tells you on here, um, it tells you the exact elevation of that point. So this, this one is uh, uh, for Mount Marcy and it says 5,344 feet. So this, they put it on the top of Mount Marcy and they would embed this in the bedrock and they used that as a reference point. Now, this is not a real one, this is a replica one because if it was a real one, I'd be subject to a $250 fine or possible imprisonment. So this is only a replica I bought on the internet. But anyway, so that's a benchmark. So it looked like that, and then that number right there would represent what the elevation of that point is. Campground, picnic area, a windmill, sunken wreck, um, find that in the water. Uh, so ships know to avoid that. All right, so those are examples of some cultures, a lot more symbols than that. All right, so what we're gonna do today is basically we're gonna construct a contour map and then on the map, we're going to put the proper symbols um, at certain coordinates. So we're going to basically be making a contour map to represent this island right there. All right. And to do so on this paper, uh, the second paper here, you can rip off. And what you're gonna do is each one of these shapes right there, we'll just say these guys right here, uh, represents a contour level. Um, so you're gonna cut that out along, this, along the solid lines, cut all these out under the solid lines. And then on your paper, uh, you're gonna put some glue there. And then this is the first level. And then you can put the second level on there put some glue, then put a third level on there, put some glue, then the fourth level on there, and so forth until you get all the way up to the top. And then on the back of this, it gives you specific directions to what you're gonna do to the map. So um, uh, it tells you to put streams in a certain location. Um, for example, the number six on here, it tells you to place a symbol for a swamp at five degrees, three minutes north, 140 degrees, six minutes west. All right, well, so five degrees, three minutes north, 140 degrees, six minutes west, that put me right there. And then there's a symbol for a marsh or swamp right there. And I, I put that symbol right there in the map. So um, you have all the layers glued, you follow the directions, they'll tell you to put stuff in there for the scale and then I'll tell you to put various uh, culture on the map at various coordinates. And when you get done, you can just take a picture of the map there when you're done and upload it. And that was that.